Okay, so today we're going to talk about lipid digestion. So you obviously know that lipids are broken down by lipases. Okay, lipases are found in the pancreas and then are secreted into the small intestine. However, before then, something else has to come along and basically break these lipids down into smaller molecules to increase the surface area. And now, um, that is the job of bile, okay, or more specifically bile salts. So bile salts will, um, will get made by the liver, they get stored in the gallbladder, and they will then get released into the small intestine. So what they do is they, they split these lipid molecules into tiny droplets called micelles. Okay, so they're the small droplets of fat. So, so the, the whole job of this is just to increase surface area for um, f for digestion. So it makes it the whole process quicker. This whole process, as you should remember from GTC, is called emulsification. So once they are emulsified, lipases come along and they essentially hydrolyze, they break down the ester bond, okay, where I've highlighted here over here on the left, this bond in here, they highlight, they, they highlight, they, they break down this bond and they form, so lipases form fatty acids and also monoglycerides. So now what we've got are um, some fatty acids and monoglycerides that need to be absorbed. Okay, so if we just draw that out then, here's a, um, here's a lipid droplet. Okay, and that obviously will get broken down into monoglycerides and fatty acids. Okay, and they're forming these little structures called micelles. Okay, um, so what they do then, they then will then work their way through the small intestine and once they come into contact with um, a, a epithelial cell, they'll essentially disassociate, dissociate with each other. Okay, and they'll get absorbed just through simple diffusion through the uh, epithelial cell. So if we have monoglycerides, okay, there's a monoglyceride, a couple of them there, some fatty acids, fatty acids, tails there, um, and here we have an epithelial cell, really rubbish epithelial cell, and these simply just pass through by simple diffusion, pass through the, the phospholipid bilayer, uh, mainly because they're, they're a non-polar molecule, they can get through there pretty easy, they're pretty small as well. So, once they're in the epithelial cell, um, they, because they're, they're now soluble, they need to basically reform. Okay, they need to reform together into a triglyceride. Okay, they do that with the help of the endoplasmic reticulum. So there's the endoplasmic reticulum. Okay. Um, so the endoplasmic reticulum, and also the Golgi body as well. So ER, then Golgi, reform, um, monogies, and fatty acids into triglycerides. Okay, they tend to combine them with things like cholesterol. So there's cholesterol there, uh, and also things called lipoproteins. Uh, and they form structures, we'll just draw them here once they're formed. And these structures are known as chylomicrons. Chylomicrons. Um, so these are now, uh, they're insoluble, they can travel in the bloodstream, they can travel in um, vessels called lymphatic vessels, which we're going to come on to in a minute, uh, and hence they can go around the body and be de deposited or be used up wherever they're needed. So how do they get released then? Well, what happens is, we'll just rub that little bit out there and we'll draw 
this process here. This process is known as exocytosis. Okay, it's just expelling of something out of a cell, exocytosis. Uh, whereas endocytosis would be uh, engulfing a cell. Something like phagocytosis would be, a, a, be a, uh, an endocytotic movement here. Okay, uh, and what that ha what happens next is they then travel through something called the lymphatic system. There's a lymphatic vessel at the bottom here. Okay, and that will go to the bloodstream. Okay, um, these this lymph, these lymphatic vessels you might have heard of them. Um, they're called lacteals. Okay, they're just a, um, vessels that, that are adapted for carrying fat. Okay, and they're found basically through the centre of each of these these villi, these villi.